by Ben Shuttleworth and managers. Those handful of people that are cunningly disguised as trade unionists, who have a trade union bone in their body, you can keep this on camera, Scott, as well, for all of them. Because I've had a number of them that have come to me and said, during the build-up to our ballot result, saying to me, I'll leave off till, including senior people from Unite, tell, can you leave off calling them all bullies and all that, because some of us are trade unionists as well. And my, re my response was, well, you prove it to me then. You prove it to me. Because you have benefited off of every fight this trade union has had to see that we win. and protect our job, by definition we protect their jobs. So I said, you've got a chance now. You know the people that have taken over this industry. You know what they, what they want to intend to do to it. Well, you get behind us then. You get behind our ballot and support us. So they rejected a pay deal, right? Which I think was 2.6, one year pay deal, and they had bonuses. They rejected it. And you might have said to me, we're going to look to ballot money. So management have pulled them in, haven't they? They've pulled them in, and they've offered them, as far as I can see, it's the same pay deal, but they've offered them the same the following year. So we have no money, but they're getting two, two pay deals, and I think they're giving them a thousand pounds of their bonus. Nowhere near what they should have done. And they have taken it, or the negotiators have taken it. Whether the members accept that, but I assume they will, because I tell you now, that is a clear case of bought and paid for. Those people have been bought off when they know the scour is water they're going to. So don't let any of them anymore, ever again, come to me and say, back off because I'm a trade unionist and all. I'll tell you, not, you're not, I look at the camera here, anyone, anyone see this video? All you managers, you accept that deal, you are scared, as far as I'm concerned. <laughs> Every single one of them will benefit. What sort of person knows that now and knows the fight we're going in who would still try and make it even harder for us? They know what they stand to get out of it and they're just hoping that we deliver it. All of them will come up privately and they're going, oh, support you. I know what you're saying. You're absolutely right about these new managers. And they do ring up. Don't worry about that, mate. Pretty high up at all. They tell me how this disillusioned they are. But they will still take the money and let us have the fight. I'm sorry, that ain't the sort of honour and dignity amongst working people that I talk about. That's why I don't recognise that as dignity and honour and pride. I really don't. That is something that's... They can get under a snake with a top hat on, these people. <laughs> absolutely good. They're prepared to do that. They've got no backbone. They've got no arsehole. And they don't, they're not proper trade unionists. So stop keep trying to trade under the name of Unite. I think they'd be sold to Unite. And I'll tell you, there's some really good people at the top of Unite who'll be disgusted with the fact that they would allow themselves to be bought off while we go into that fight. So, um, what do I think of them? <laughs> <laughs> Have I covered that off for you? Is that all right? All right. And when you're walking in and do our work, you can remind them of that and use some of it if you want to. So, listen, don't let them ever drag you down. You are so much better than them, every single one of you. You're better than the people at the top of all now, because you're not prepared to go away and be, do it on your own and leave everyone else behind. We stand together. Great right? workers always should stand together. Because the one thing that happens in life and work is, is they always get shit on, unless they stand up and defend themselves. And this union will do it as far as I'm concerned. All the time I've got breath in my body on in this job, I will not allow 
even if I'm under pressure from people saying they don't want to take action or it's all too difficult. I will not allow sit in a room or sign something off that takes the piss out of our members. I will never do it.